today. I don't know if you can see him, he's so short. Ten years old out there shooting people. He's been playing since he was six years old. You are the future of paintball. I'm all the way from New Jersey. And now I have the mic over to uh, Paul. Let's find out who won. Yeah. All right. Who really thinks that Red won? Yeah. Who really thinks that Blue won? Both teams won. That's what I thought. All right. First of all, I know there's a lot of thank yous given out, but I'm going to give a, a very special one. In all the big games since the beginning, you know, it's coordination is incredibly important and making this thing run proper. And out of all the years, the lines have been the shortest at every single station. The game has run smoothest. And I actually want to give a shout out. Guys, guys. Bad girl. You guys, listen up. I want to give a shout out to Scott Seppi, the field manager, because this is the most, the best, most well-organized big game we've had in the history. So let's give a shout out for him. Is that all you got? Okay, we have, I'll give you Saturday. On Saturday, the red team, I'm sorry, the blue team had 2,159 points. And the red team had 2,029 points. So the blue team wins Saturday. It's pretty close. From what I understood, the blue team was pretty dominant, and the red team was pretty smart, right? And that's how that came close. On Sunday, it was also a relatively close game. So I'll just, with no further ado, in the same order, randomly, the blue team, 4,392 points. And the red team, 4,908 points! Yeah. 